Hello everybody and welcome to the month of March and hey I'm sure you can guess what the colour is it's that wonderful magenta this is the colour of transformation it's the colour of change and yes we really 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 want some of that around us now we want the sun to come out we know on the 21st of March we're coming into the spring equinox so we're going to change our clocks, have more daylight, things will definitely feel more uplifted. But this particular colour allows us also to transform our environments and transform our energies. It's two parts red, one part blue. So therefore we can move forward, we can start using that red of movement, but keeping the blue so that we're able to balance and negotiate. You don't have to wear the colour, I happen to quite like it too, but I've got a lovely little pot of primroses here that are magenta, so something like that in your eye, remember 25% of what you see is for your vision, 75% is working on your body. And with magenta, the working on your body is actually in the whole of your aura. Magenta rules the eighth chakra the soul star chakra it's the one that keeps all the akashic records all our history of who we've been where we've been where we're going who we really are so this is a month where we can transform ourselves into what we really want to be and what we want to achieve so i'm really excited for march i do bring a bit of color in to counteract my magenta, you can have green, which will allow balance. It brings us into the heart energy and it's its complementary colour. You can bring in a little bit of yellow, which I love together with this, because it actually helps to stimulate the mind. So we have the backdrop of the blue year energy of truth and integrity, of healing and this month we can go out there and really transform ourselves our relationships our environment to become the change that we want to see in the world so i wish you a really happy march and enjoy the magenta thanks for listening